What's up, familia? Miranda here, and today we are gonna go a little movie hunting at Big Lots. Been about a month since we've been here. I don't suspect that much will be new, but hey, um, we were in the area, uh, came to the post office right next door, so I um, thought we would go ahead and do a little hunting today. All right, you guys, so my store only has the one fixture here, as you guys saw before in a previous video. Um, I don't know if all stores is just one fixture, but anywho, so looking here at all the season sets and stuff like that, not a whole lot going on here. Um, I do see house season one here last time I was here I got the first season but it was like five bucks this season one for eight bucks I don't know I'm tempted to get it but at the same time I think eight bucks is a bit much since I got the sixth season for five so I don't know all right so moving along there's some criminal minds but I have all of these seasons um this one here the beyond borders I never got into this I think this is like after the uh, original season ended, so not really interested in that one. What else is here? Streets of San Francisco, Get Shorty, a lot of untouchables. So not really a whole lot going on here. How many seasons is this one? CSI, all oh, seasons one through three, but it's 15 bucks. We also have CSI Miami, seasons four through six. What is the other one? CSI Miami, one through three. So one through three and four through six. That's actually not bad, but I'm sure that these are all like 15. Yep. But like 30 bucks for seasons one through six. Not terrible. All right, not a huge Blu-ray selection. All ones here that have been at Dollar Tree. Pretty much all of them. Hugo. I do have this in like a multi-pack. I'm tempted to get this one, but I don't know. So yeah, I have everything from there. I'm um, surprised. This is the first time I'm seeing CDs here. Fantasia. I don't know whatever happened to her. I liked her when she was on American Idol. Wonder when I see. Um, I think this is a new one. I don't know. I don't recognize any songs on it. John Mayer. <laughs> Mark Anthony. Who's that? I don't know. Mm -hmm. eh, not much going on there. What is this? The Kite Runner? Alright, I do see Blue Valentine. This was not here last time. Three bucks for that. Um, this one too was not here last time. This is actually pretty cool. Um, so I do actually have the Blu-ray saved on my wish list, but this one has South Park and Team America. This is the bigger, uh, longer, and uncut. So that's kind of cool there. What all else is here? Redox Rings, World Without Thieves, Outpost, Beverly Hills Cop, um, Patriot Games, Paranormal Abduction, There's Sushi Girl. All right, next up we have, I see Unsane here. And not a whole, whole lot going on here. What is this, Martha Marcy? What is this? Marcy May Mar, what? Martha Marcy May Marlene, that's a mouthful. I have no idea what that is. All right, it looks like there's some more seasons down here, mixed in with some other titles. Whiskey Tango Foxtrot. All right, got some more going on there. Not a whole, whole lot. All right, some more stuff here. Again, not really much going on. I do see this, though, the Children of the Corn Genesis. Um, I, gosh, I haven't seen any of the Children of the Corn movies in a really long time. This one is from 2010, so I've not seen this one. Yeah. Right, next row here, the only different one that I've seen is this. It's the uh, double movie collection, Cloverfield, 10 Cloverfield Lane. I have the first Cloverfield, but I don't have 10 Cloverfield Lane. Oh. Right, I see a double feature of the Spiderwick Chronicles and Series of Unfortunate Events. Do have both those movies, but that's kind of a nice little set there. Uh, what is this? The Brink? No idea what that's about. 
Zoolander number two. I have the first one in a multi-feature. Um, American Conjuring. The Divine Fury. Alright, so moving on to the kids section. Not much Blu-ray wise. Um, I do see... The Adventures of Rocky and Bullwinkle. I have not seen this in ages. Okay. Nothing really too interesting here. What else is here? Um, yeah, not really a whole lot there. I never really have a good selection of like kid stuff. Alright, so I see some Ninja Turtles, and then this. I've never even heard of this show, Melissa and Joey. Like, wow, it has Melissa Joan Hart, you guys. I don't know whatever happened to her. Um, but yeah, so that's uh, season one, part two. Alright, you guys, so not a whole lot was new at my big loss in the month that passed since I'd last been there. Lots of those, like, Dollar Tree titles, as you could see. Um, but I did pick up a few things nonetheless. No Blu-rays, unfortunately. Um, straight up DVDs. So let's just go ahead and see what all I picked up. So I did go ahead and pick up Blue Valentine, you guys. This is a film that I've been wanting to see for a while now. Um, it... I think it's like 18 bucks on Amazon, so I think I'll just stick with the DVD for now because you guys know me. I'm a bit of a cheapo here, um, but you do have Ryan Gosling in this, and this is one that I heard good things about, so I went ahead and picked that up. This, too, I had to get. I thought this was a pretty good deal. Um, you do have South Park, uh, Bigger, Longer, and Uncut, and then you have uh, Team America. I haven't seen anything South Park in a really, really long time, you guys. I've actually never seen Team America. I know this one is kind of a pretty bad film um I don't really remember too much about it I think I've only seen it maybe in parts but never the whole thing but I'm super excited to revisit South Park you guys um so two movies for five bucks I thought that was a pretty good deal next up we do have the DVD of Unsane uh, I really don't know anything about this film though I have seen many many people hauling it obviously you know on blu-ray but I figured for three bucks I'd go ahead and check it out and if I do end up liking it I will probably upgrade um, but it is some sort of a suspense drama, so I want to go ahead and check it out. Alright, and one I've been wanting to add to the collection for a while now is The Adventures of Rock and Bullwinkle. The Blu-ray goes for 20 bucks on Amazon, you guys. So I think I'm good with the DVD again. <laughs> um, it's just cheaper this way, so I went ahead and picked this up. I have not seen this in such a long time, you guys. So I'm actually really excited to revisit this one, and hopefully the kiddos will enjoy it as well. Then I did go ahead and pick up Children of the Corn Genesis, like I had mentioned in store. I haven't seen any of the Children of the Corn movies in such a long time. I know when I was younger they used to really freak me out and I haven't seen them since then. So um, this one is from 2010, so it's a newer one, sort of. Um, so I'm looking forward to checking it out. I don't know how well this one holds up to like, you know, the first or the second. But uh, yeah, Children of the Corn Genesis. And then I did cave, you guys. I went ahead and picked up House Season 1 for 8 bucks. Um, it goes for like 15 on Amazon. Um, it is a DVD set. I wish it would have been the Blu-ray because the season six that I found last time I was there, um, it was for five bucks and it was on Blu-ray. But I really, really wanted this, you guys. I did enjoy the show when it was on and um, hopefully I can find the other seasons. I did actually end up finding on Amazon that they have like an actual set of it. I know there is a Blu-ray set, but it's like, a, I don't know if it's like one of the other regions or a region free. So it has a little circle thingies on it, which I won't be getting because like I've mentioned before, I, I just think it takes away from, you know, the whole artwork, the packaging, stuff like that. Um, but I did see actually that there was a Blu-ray set, but the reviews on it weren't very great. Lots of people were receiving like broken cases and um just other issues wrong with it like wrong discs and you know a couple of the same discs there or something like that so I don't know I may eventually pick it up you know give it a try see if it comes okay but for now I'm settling with this season one and then, like I said I do have season six already so at least I have two of the eight seasons um but yeah so I went ahead and caved and got this so that's everything that I got today at Big Lots, you guys. Go ahead, check out your stores. Let me know what you have found recently. And uh, hopefully you guys can find some good stuff at your Big Lots stores. Thanks for watching, everyone. Join the family if you have not. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.